Speedbox. Break the limits. Speedbox 1.2 for Bosch with rim magnet, optionally with B tuning. Necessary tools. Removing the rim magnet. Speed sensor installation. Place the magnet with the smooth side facing the end of the speed sensor. Removing the cover. Speed box installation. Now test the signal of the box labeled rim magnet simulator. Place the box under the lower part of the motor as close to the chainstay as possible. Turn on the e-bike, wait 20 seconds, then turn the rear wheel. If the real speed appears on the display, you can attach the rim magnet simulator firmly with double-sided tape. If no speed appears on the display, slightly move the box and repeat the test by turning the rear wheel until the signal is alright. We recommend fixing the rim magnet simulator in the motor compartment. In the same way, you can attach the rim magnet simulator to the bike frame. Cover assembly.
Tuning Control After the first turning on of the e-bike after the tuning installation it is necessary to enter the menu and check the wheel circumference of your e-bike. You can activate and deactivate speed box by entering the walk assist mode briefly. In this case by pressing the minus button for a while. The display shows values of 3.5 or 2.5, depending on whether the speed box is active or inactive. Activate or deactivate the tuning before the ride, not during riding. If you do not have a walk function enabled on your e-bike, you can also activate or deactivate the tuning by switching between two assistance modes twice. When riding with the tuning turned on, the speed displayed is slightly lower than the real one. When you stop your e-bike, the ongoing countdown process will be indicated by the increasing and then decreasing speed. Once the countdown process is completed, the display shows 0.0 km per hour. The length of the countdown may take several minutes, depending on the style of your ride. You can set the maximum speed of the electric assistance by switching the modes quickly in the order shown in the video. The maximum speed of the electric assistance can be set by activation and deactivation of the walk function. The last displayed limit will be saved after 15 seconds of inactivity. However, we recommend not to exceed a speed of 35 km per hour. The maximum speed of the electric assistance can also be set by spinning the rear wheel. If you have the B-Tuning version, you can pair your e-bike with the Speedbox app. Non-B-Tuning versions do not have a Bluetooth technology and cannot be paired with your smartphone. This mobile application allows you to monitor your performance, view diagnostic data of your e-bike, control the tuning and save your trips. The Speedbox app home screen displays your riding data and information about both yours and motor's power and energy consumption. The diagnostics part then shows even more detailed parameters of your ride, e-bike and battery. In settings you may change the PIN or service password, reset the Speedbox, set the speed warning or speed limit and switch between kilometers and miles.